In this time track tutorial, we're going to take a look at submitting time with straight time and overtime. In our example today, we're going to be entering time for an employee who works from 7 a.m. to 6 p.m., taking a one hour break for lunch from noon to one. First of all, let's go ahead and log into the system. And then we're going to verify the date range is, pro is correct. And the date range can be found right here. Uh, in our example, we come in at 7 leave for lunch at noon, come back at 1, and then leave the office at 6. And we're going to go ahead and fill the rest of the week out like that. Okay, now that we have all of our hours in, you can see that we've worked a total of 10 hours per day. Uh, that's a total of 50 hours throughout the week. Now, we have, to, we have these allocation balances that we have to allocate to the particular pay types. Now, since we're over 40 hours in the week, that means that there is going to be overtime. Uh, so, for our first 40, is going to be straight time. This pay type is already straight time. And we're going to go ahead and allocate 10 hours here, 10 hours here, 10 hours here, and 10 hours here. Now you'll notice that takes us to a grand total of 40. Uh, that is the straight time limit. Anything over that is going to be overtime. On the pay type here, on the second line, we're going to click the drop down box and select overtime. If you have a question about which pay type you should be allocating your time to, please ask your manager. They'll be able to let you know. And so on the line where we have overtime, we're going to go ahead and allocate 10 hours there. So we've got our 50 hours, 40 at straight time, and then 10 at overtime. The last thing to do is submit for approval. It will ask you if you want to submit the sheet for approval. Simply say OK. It will process the sheet, and you will receive this notice that it's been submitted for approval. Behind the scenes, the system has sent an email to your manager letting them know that you have submitted your time and it's in the system for their approval.